hello friends welcome to my channel in this video I'm going to show you a 2d ping pong multi-level game uh, I have created it using Pygame that is a Python library okay so uh, I will show you the uh, working actually the, there are three difficulty levels in this game one is easy one is medium and the third one is uh, this difficult level so let me show you the working here all right so this is your uh, front gui that is graphical is user interface so you can see when i hover my this uh, pointer at these three uh, texts they change the color so if you uh, choose quit this window will be closed so just like that and uh, suppose you want to play the game then uh, you have to choose one of the level so let us suppose I am choosing here as easy level so in easy level uh, there are see there are two players here and both are human i mean you have to play with another person okay so in this level uh, this paddle uh, is quite lengthy width of the paddle uh, is small but length is quite big so that's why this is a easy level uh, now let us suppose you don't want to play this game further okay you can simply choose uh, you can uh, uh, press the escape key on the uh, keyboard and this game will get i mean you you then you can choose another game okay so these three options they will again pop up on the window so suppose I want to play another easy or maybe medium game, uh, medium level uh, game. So in medium difficulty level, you can see there is a uh, this paddle length is smaller, okay, and there is one distraction uh, that is a flying balloon. And this balloon doesn't do uh, anything except it just keeps flying around. So it is there to distract your mind okay so uh, and also this uh, ball speed it can get uh, you know uh, quite high uh, high sometimes it will get you know sometimes it will get quite uh, speedy so uh, you cannot tell when it can get speedy because I have uh, chosen the random speed uh, random speed and range is higher than that in the easy level so so you can see ball speed now it is high so that is why this is a medium level and uh, suppose you want to play this difficult then you can see there are two balls and points are uh, points are scored with uh, any of the ball if it goes out of the boundary your point will get scored so two balls and there are two distractions two balloons so that is why this is a difficult level so maximum score i have kept 10 so let me reach the score 10 so that you can see how the game finishes if a player won if a player wins so uh, let me see okay so there will be a winner now when the score is 10 okay so player b won so p player b won and it it shows this text that player b won and again you have the option to play another game or you can quit okay so just like that you can click easy and again another game will start so this is a this is the complete working and for player a i have kept keys w and s for forward and i mean for up and down moment of the paddle and for the right player that is player b uh, it is up key up arrow key and down arrow key on the keyboard so that is how they move and ball it simply moves around you don't have to do anything for the ball 
so i hope you like this game and if you uh, um, let me tell you also that this is a class based game so there are uh, concepts of oops which are used in this game and uh, nothing uh, more than you know this pi game nothing more is used so you don't need to install anything special to run this game except uh, this pi game module of the python so if you need the code for this game you can definitely buy it from me i will give the link in the description box you can simply pay using your cards and you will get the code uh, in the uh, code folder you will get three uh, more files and those are uh, the image files which i have used in this game so don't change any name of the file or uh, uh, anything in the uh, folder don't delete any file simply uh, extract all the files from that zip folder there will be four files one will be this python file and three images so uh, you just need to keep these files together within a folder or wherever you want to keep them just keep them all in one place and then uh, run this pi file that is uh, pong underscore class dot pi file you have to run that file in your ide which can be pycharm or which can be uh, your uh, visual studio code any or any other id which you use okay and this game will start so that's all you need to do and uh, i i'm using python 3 3.7 something so uh, 3.7.9 so it would be better if you are using this um, python 3 okay i don't know if it works with python 2.7 or not i think that um, because maybe there are many upgradations so better you install python 3 not python 2 and make sure pygame is your pygame module is installed that's all so uh, that's all for now thank you and uh, take care bye bye